Hey you guys, in this video I will show you how you can install Keycloak in just a few clicks super easily. And if you don't know what Keycloak is, it's an awesome open source identity and access management tool. The first step to install is to click the link down below, which will give you a $200 free credit trial for 60 days and put in your email, password, and click create free account. And now that you've signed up and you're in the dashboard, the next step is to click create in the menu and click droplets, which will allow you to create a server. DigitalOcean calls servers droplets. And you can go ahead and select the region of your choice and then you can scroll down and you're gonna go ahead and click marketplace. And then we're gonna go ahead and search for a key cloak and we're gonna go ahead and select it. And then we're going to go ahead and scroll down. We're going to select our server size. Feel free to select whatever pricing you'd like. And then we can enable backups if we'd like, either weekly or daily. I'm going to keep that unchecked because I want to save some money for this tutorial. And then we're going to scroll down and we can add an SSH key or we can add a password to log into our server. If you have an SSH key and want to add it, go ahead and click new SSH key. And then we're gonna scroll down. I do recommend you check this where it says add improved metric monitoring and alerting. It's for free and it's an awesome feature DigitalOcean has. And then we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna go ahead and click create droplet. It's going to take about one minute for our droplet to be created. And once it's created, you'll see a green dot right here. And we're gonna go ahead and copy our IP address. And now we're gonna log into our server really quick to get our admin and password for the dashboard and you type in ssh space root at and then your ip address and hit enter and now that we're logged into the server if we scroll up you can see our database credentials right here if we want to log into our database and then we'll have access to our dashboard right here and we're going to go ahead and copy the ip address and then we're going to paste it into our browser however you're going to see it's not going to work so you need to put colon 8443 at the end, which will allow you to access the port that Keycloak is running on. Now, if we run it with that port, it's gonna say, warning, potential security risk ahead. And we're just gonna ignore it and we're gonna click advance and then we're gonna come down here and we're gonna click accept the risk and continue. And then we're gonna grab the password that we saw when we logged into the server and we're gonna come here put in the password and then type in admin and go ahead and click sign in. And now you can see Keycloak has been successfully installed on our server and you can play around with the settings and set everything up. And if you wanna find more information, for example, how to set up multiple domains on this server and install SSL certificates for them, you can go ahead and click here where it says get started and then you can scroll all the way down until you see where it talks about configuring nginx and you can click this link how to set up nginx server blocks and then you can start adding domains and start installing ssl certificates if you guys found that this video helpful make sure to like comment and subscribe and i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial